What up, bitch? What's the Saints? It's your boy with the band in the colors. Young Trey back with another Fight Night Champion mode gameplay. In the last episode, if you missed it, go back and check it out. Uh, Mr. McQueen was threatening us, of all people, that we should join him in his promotion. But no, Bishop is not going down like that he's one of the loyal ones staying loyal to Gus and all that he, that's his you know his uh, own form of custom motto and all that but after all that we're getting right back into it so um how y'all doing out there before y'all before we even start how y'all feeling y'all doing all right good if not then this video is where you need to be hopefully I can make you smile laugh or just help you know, help you enjoy some stuff and get you distracted. So sit back, relax, grab a snack, and chill like a Mac. Let's get in, man. Ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, everybody. Joe Tessitore and Teddy Atlas welcoming you to the Aragon Ballroom here in Chicago, Illinois, for a much-anticipated main event. Ricardo Alvarez is an established contender. Andre right. Bishop right is a hot Protect rising yourself prospect. At all time. Will Bishop shine in the spotlight? Whatever well, you think he's done throughout his career from the amateurs eight to rounds okay. moment now. Knock Alvarez out to win the fight this fight. Really solid left hand by Andre Bishop. That's exactly what his corner wants him to do. Good looking jab there. Okay. Let's go. Mm. Step back, counter punch there. Alright, so this look like this is a match that's gonna go the distance, many, many and he's pretty quick. I'm, I should just lay it, um, don't wear him out if I can. Fighter, can be a I'm gonna just do counter punches, to be honest. Yes, be but besides that, I wanted to talk bit. to y'all about some ideas I have for the Good channel, especially for, like, for uh, sports. You know, because I feel like right now, sports nice is what's attracting people to my channel as of right now. Anything, like any game that I play that consists of sports, even if it's like a parry type of game. Like, for instance, one of the biggest videos I ever played on here was the Space Jam for PlayStation 1. And that's one of my biggest videos on the channel. So, um, I was thinking I started this new... Damn, he tagged me up. But I started this new... This new, uh, what's it called? Dang. Ooh, I'm trying to concentrate and talk at the same time. I'm not good at that. But I started this new series called Recreate or Rewrite. With... It's pretty much I'm playing any sports game, whether it's basketball, boxing, especially with boxing, UFC, um, wrestling, and I'm recreating classic matches and you know face to face type matches to see if they can rewrite history or if they can recreate. So, for instance, like I got two episodes. Oh, Judges ain't even watching this fight. I can see it in their eyes. McQueen fucked us. We're not winning any decisions tonight. Hmm. Means you you gotta think? Knock this guy on the canvas. Understand? Knock him on his ass. All right. Damn, I don't even look Here like I go. got any uh stamina back. But like I was saying, recreate and rewrite is pretty much a new series I'm gonna try to start where I can recreate um classic matches. Like for instance, I put up two matches between Muhammad Ali and Sonny Liston, which he which was realistic. They only fought two times out of Muhammad Ali's career. And Muhammad Ali won both of them. The second the first one went the distance and the second bout they faced off. Muhammad Ali knocked out Liston within like the first round if I'm not mistaken. So basically I put like say if they face the first time I go do a simulation on Hall of Fame wow, he difficulty sound. and see if I could recreate or if Sonny Liston could actually beat Muhammad Ali 
the first time like what if type and scenarios and if they go the distance so say Muhammad good, Ali wins like both of them each encounter that they have like a two out of three type match then there's no need for a third round but if say Sonny Liston happens to have an upset and beat Muhammad Ali where they're tied up then I could have a third match a what if match as if they meet for the third time to sell the score so something like that you know, right now it's gaining some traction. And I think it would be cool to see. You know, people love that. So I like it too. Especially with boxing, you never know. Just or dream matches we just never could really see in real life. You know, I'm gonna do different matches for Roy Jones, Mike Tyson, uh Floyd Mayweather, Pacquiao, all of that. So that's just something I did. I just wanna run across y'all. So Oh boy, what a break he just caught. The bell rings okay. at the end of the round. Saved by the bell. Okay, okay, corner, round three. Well, so far, so good. House, We're putting you know, you bruises on the more, face, putting the bruises on the face. You gotta wait for it to dry a little bit. You gotta wait for your guy to wake up. You gotta wait for the cobwebs to go away before you can do Let's more Let's go not. Okay, knock out. That's crazy. I can't knock him out because the game won't let me. Because plot armor. Thank you. Every time I have my flashing stamina or unlimited stamina like this, I can't knock him out. See, the game won't let me. Good lord. See, look at this. The game got plot armor. I gotta knock him out in a certain level, like a certain round, excuse me. Yeah, he's gotta be saying, what do I have to do to get rid of this guy? See, look at this. I'm just, so I'm just whooping his butt for no reason, just cause, causing cuts and blood. See, look at this. This is ridiculous. Come on. Cut. Like the referee, you just gonna you you just gonna stand there? You just gonna let? Look at the referee, he just wa watching this go down. Like I'm just cutting this dude up for nothing, just uppercuts for days. Look at this, this ain't fair. So I'm just whooping his butt for three minutes straight, just straight hits uh, with unlimited stamina. That's crazy. He is you gotta stop this. This is straight, straight brutality. This is just. A, this has to be illegal. I'm going to jail after this match. Oh my good lord. He's not. Yo, the referee just. He must be a masterpiece for me to allow. Uh, to allow me to just whip this dude to shreds without. <laughs> stopping the fight. The, the game is acting crazy. Hits him in the mug with the right. And he blocking like it's nothing. Just a thudding shot there that Oh now he now he's fighting back. Oh now you wanna fight back. And the bell rings signifying the end of the That's not realistic. He would be dead <laughs> in real life, even with gloves on. That was a massacre. Now can I knock him out? Just not himself. I think that last round. About time. Big uppercut right there. He had no I barely hit him. Big, Dang. Big shot you saw how? Oh my goodness. Y'all saw his that but his body right twerk. That looked like the great pitch of great magic. You saw. Oh my goodness. His body just like it snapped. I don't even. That happened so fast. I it looked like he was about to put him in the chokehold. 11 and 0. We were ready to make a move. My future looked bright. Uh oh. Why nice do you always place. stay here? The gym's closed, fellas. Those last one here. We didn't come here to work out. What's going on? We came to have a little talk. You didn't have to touch me. Well, damn, you kind of overreacted right there. And damn, you gonna just shoot me? That was just dumb. Thugs. 
But they were cops. Dirty cops on McQueen's payroll. Wrong fucking move, kid. Wrong fucking move. Good evening, everyone. I'm Brian. Kind of overreacted there, Night Bishop. Here on ESPN. Before we get into tonight's action, some shocking news this week involving middleweight lie. prospect and amateur gold medalist Andre Bishop. Reports are coming in that Bishop has been arrested for allegedly carrying an unlicensed firearm. Where did those bruises come from? Two police officers. He didn't even get hit. He got hit in the back of the head and he got bruises over, in the late over hours his of face. The evening between Bishop and the police at Carisi's Boxing Club, the gym where Bishop trains. The word of two decorated police officers was all it took. My dreams, my freedom, everything was taken from me. Everybody up! Cell block D, get up! I'm locked up, they won't Nobody let me out. Me. I had to help myself. I couldn't let this place beat me. And the bins. I did what I had to do. I fought. Those crackers been talking so much about kicking your ass, they think they can take you one on one. I had to agree to some conditions, though. Bare knuckles. No refs, no rounds. You fight until somebody quits. Or can't get up. I like those conditions. Where? And let's go get it on. Where? I get to bust some hate. <laughs> Remember now, the professional boxing shit ain't gonna help you here. You got to knock this motherfucker out. You got the nerve to have skull and bones on your chest. I'm gonna teach you. Wait, you with the skull and bones, I'm about to knock you out in the name of the Lord. Look at you. Uh, uh, uh. Look at you. Can't handle me. Get the. Look at that. Four punch knockout. Death breed, yeah. That's what you met with. Death. One, two, three, this is something else. Four, Want some more, crap? Come on. Man, this is nothing. Look at this. Look at this. Andre is in rare form. I like it. I like it. I love it, I love it. You got up for more? Look at, what in the... Do I really need to say more? Do I need to say anything? Look at this. Got the nerve to have a gun on the back of his back. Like on his... You, you just got random tats for no reason. Don't even know what you representing. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Who next? What's this I hear about you signing with DL McQueen? <laughs> no way, Adrian. Yo, Ms. McQueen told me Pop was gonna do the same thing. And you believe that? I believe this. <laughs> bling, bling. The queen has done a lot for me. And Dre, I'm going to be smart. I'm going to let him keep doing what he's doing. Raymond, you'd be smart to stay away from a queen, man. I always wanted you I to... I ain't you, Dre. I'm me. I'm a heavyweight, Mr. McQueen. Mr. McQueen believes I can be the champ. The champ. I'm going for it, brother. I got to do what's best for me. How's Gus taking him? I had to let Gus go. Raymond, no. I didn't have no choice, Dre. Gus can't give me a shot at the title. Mr. McQueen can. Dad realized that too late, and I can't make that same mistake. I got to do what's best for me and not what's best for Gus. Dre. Come on, man. You understand. <coughs> it's like that. 
It's like that, Dre. It's like that. <laughs> it's like that, Dre. It's like that, Dre. retired from boxing. Isaac Frost became heavyweight champion. Mm -mm -mm. Baby brother was fulfilling his dream. And here, it's the same old business. Time to skin another head. Where? Another one? Maybe they, maybe, Andre, maybe he needs to listen to your younger brother. Maybe he's right. Cause look at his, look, look at his fit. Homeboy was bling blinging. No, he, look at this fool. He tried to headbutt me. He missed it. You saw that? Look at that. He missed it. All he did, all his head was juggling was saying yes. That's all he, ugh. You see the slobber? Ugh. Where's your teeth? Homeboy oh didn't have no teeth. Look at his face just jiggling. Just jiggle. Just jiggle. <laughs> his you saw his feet go up. Try to hit me in the nuts again. I'm getting sick of you. Back up, back up. Come on. Stop hitting me in my genitals. Good God. These. Is this how? This is how they be doing it in jail please stay down oh my goodness he got up like nothing happened yo stop okay, okay. you wanna hit mm. had to hit you in the head okay I'll take that I'll take that please just stay down cause you just obsessed with my private parts for some strange reason. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Hey, B. Hey, B. Hey, motherfucker. This shit isn't finished. What the hell are you talking about? I'm ready to fight right now. Get your boy ready. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He just had a fight. He ain't had time to rest. I don't fucking care, Ace. He's gonna fight me right now, or there's gonna be serious problems. Man, you're skinny, bud. Fuck it. Let's go. Why am I bleeding? He barely touched me. That's what I don't get. And then, what makes you think you could beat me? I beat you as a middleweight. What makes you think you could beat me as a heavyweight? You're just gonna get your butt knocked out just as much. Look at that. Boom. Got knocked out easily. Nothing. You barely even swung. That's what you. That's what you get for kicking in my face and breaking my hand. Made my hand stronger. I served my full sentence. I lost my youth. I lost my career. I lost my dream. Now what? If he cut his hair, he kind of looked like Chico Bean. Baby brother got Would me a job be? as an assistant trainer. Listen for the bell, man. Relax. Carter boy. Carter boy. Very lucky for an ex-con to have a job. Okay, That's when do I, I like get a see. break? <laughs> a brother taking care of his brother. Andre, welcome back. Hey, Mr. McQueen. Raymond? Andre, you remember Mr. Franco. Andre. Mr. Franco has retired from the force. Works for me now. Must be a big change for you. Hope you learned to stay out of trouble. Now he's learned his lesson. He retired and still can't buy a new Andre. suit. Still wearing the same suit from two, <sighs> three years ago. I'm sorry the way things worked out for you. Disgusting. But I've been taking be good care of Raymond while you were away. We can't afford 
distractions. I hope we can count on you to help your brother. It was good just to be back in the gym. It was good to see baby brother doing his thing. We're 20 minutes in, so I might... And this is gonna be an extended be episode. Oh my kidneys, the eye candy! Put your weight in your lead but foot. Then, pink Turn girl. your hips more. But they're Adidas. It'll increase your power. Sucky, 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 sucky. There you go. Thanks for the advice. This gym's got a reputation. I can't have people looking in here seeing me slap boxing. <laughs> Jokes, huh? Nice. I was starting to think you didn't like me. Yeah, well, being on the outside takes some getting used to. I guess I'm still adjusting. I like you just fine, Megan. Always have. I love me a girl that can box and fight. I love it. I love it. I never liked Mason Brooks. Oh. What the fuck was that, Brooks? You're supposed to be sparring. That was oh, come fuck on. you has been. This shit wasn't low. Fuck you, you know, know about it anyway. You ain't even a fighter no more. Why don't you go clean some toilets or something? Whatever. Yeah. That's right, bitch. Go clean them toilets. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I left something in there for you, too. Yo, Brooks, chill out. Oh, what? You want to do something about it? Get out of the ring, Raymond. Yeah, please. Dre, what, Give him the business. Knock his head off. Call me a collar boy. Come on. Mm, mm, yeah. what I'm talking about you bastard I heard you Excuse beat up one language. of my heavyweights look I'm sorry all right we, we were we were sparring I didn't want to Mason Brooks is an asshole he needed that beat down I like him better already in that case I'm happy to help Mason become a better person you could do better by cutting Mason's him out his contract you whipped a ranked heavyweight Okay. You're still in great shape, Andre. I know. I can get you work as a sparring partner. Go Who's on. Yours? Antoine Barr's camp starts in two weeks. Okay. 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 All right, Angels and Saints, I'm going to pause right there. All right, Angels and Saints, I'm going to stop right here. I'm going to finish up where um, I left off. But um, hopefully this video was able to lift up your spirits and, you know, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Um, like, comment, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Go check out some of my old walkthroughs. I got Def Jam Fight for New York, Def Jam Vendetta. I need to, f I got some old school joints from PlayStation 1, no uh, Nintendo 64, Sega Genesis, you got, you gonna like one of them, but, um, stay tuned for the next episode, I love y'all, and don't go nowhere, I'm literally about to come back with that next episode, peace.